Welcome to the PhotoForge tutorial. In this episode, we'll be downloading some filters from the library. There's several ways that you can download the filters. If you click at the top right filter library. If you click on that, it'll take you directly to the website where you can access the library straight from there. Or you can do it the old-fashioned way and go to Tools. If you go to Options, and if you go to the Online tab, it'll bring up the settings for Online. And you can use the old obsolete way of downloading filters. You just click on that, and then click OK, right down there. There you go. And then a button will come up that says Download More Filters. If you click on that, it'll take you to the old obsolete way. Make sure you're connected to the internet here for this. I'll come in a second. There we go. And these are all the filters that are that exist currently in the library. Over to the left, you have the different categories. This little check mark indicates that you already have this certain filter installed. You can search by author, or a type of filter, or keywords. If you go updates, these are the different filters that have been updated by the authors. Let's click on one real quick. If you look to the bottom right, this is the information about that filter. Usually you would see the thumbnails for all the filters, but my computer is just running slow since I'm capturing the screen. Let's kind of browse through here for a second. Find a couple filters to download. You can use the scroll wheel to scroll through all the different filters in that category. There we go. There's one. Grab the poster deco. Just simply select it and choose Add to Downloads. And then I'll put a little check mark there. And we'll grab one more. go. We'll grab this one here. We'll just highlight it and check Add to Downloads. And I'll put the little check mark there. Now if you look to the left, if you go under Downloads, it'll show the number two, and those will be the two filters that were downloaded. Just simply hit Download. A 
we're all done. If you look over to the left, you see your different categories. If you notice under miscellaneous and under creative, they added, it's added to that category. Let's select it and we'll go find it. There's the dial style. Like all the other filters, it's got the different settings and presets. And that's basically how you use that part of downloading filters.